Oh hey gang and welcome to Lil Internet Superstar, the cute Lone Ranger mask daily version of my latex monster head size talk show that airs every Wednesday right here on Revision 3. So you know gang, internet teaches me something new pretty much every day. And what did I learn today? I learned that there are people out there who are really, really into masks. That's right, I said masks. A simple Google search turns up countless websites dedicated to people wearing masks. And oftentimes, not much more. In case you're wondering, I'm not talking about those cute bunny rabbit or Casper the ghost masks you find in the Halloween bin at your local Walgreens. I'm talking about grown-up masks. Masks like the one on display at the website maskme.com. Girls in masks. This one site alone boasts over 14,000 pictures of women wearing masks, along with a whole lot of other interesting get-ups. Again, these are not your typical trick-or-treating masks that come with a plastic cape and a pair of paper stirrup pants. These are more along the lines of the GIMP variety. In fact, if you wore one of these masks to a child's Halloween party, the end result would likely be a lot of shame and crying and probably some fairly serious legal action. Perhaps that's why the masked bandits at MaskMe.com seem to prefer displaying their compulsion online in the relative safety of cyberspace. Either way, I must admit there's something oddly compelling about the obsessive way these women go about collecting and displaying their fetish for wearing masks. Scroll down through the front page of the site and you see mask after mask after mask worn in various lustful states of repose. There's the bunny mask. Again, not suggested for trick-or-treating or children's events of any kind. The gag mask, the blindfold mask, the tiger mask, rawr, the snakeskin mask suit get-ups, very nice, the maid mask, the all-whites, probably for when you get that invite out to the Hamptons, and apparently there's even some sort of mask that's appropriate for veggie shopping. The sheer volume of masks is something to behold. Clearly, these people are dedicated to masks and for using the internet as a means of sharing their little hobby with the world. And for that, they're today's Internet Superstars. If you have a nomination for an Internet Superstar, send it to martin at revision3.com. And be sure to check out my full-length talk show that airs every Wednesday right here on Revision 3. Till tomorrow, we'll see you in my dungeon.